Hello guys, today let's talk about a new feature of PES 3 which is architectural presets. I'm sorry for my voice a bit shaky recovering from flu but I have such a big list of videos to shoot that I decided to start with this voice. I hope you don't mind because I want to talk not that much about PEST but about the preset for Laravel which describes the recommendations of rules how Laravel projects should be structured. And I have a separate video about architectural testing in PEST which was released in 2.9 and I will link that in the description below and also if you haven't done much testing I have a few courses for beginners and advanced level. Now let me demonstrate. In one of my projects I have this line of code arc preset Laravel and there are other presets not just Laravel there's PHP and others and if I launch past tests now as you can see there's preset Laravel in addition to the executed tests and if we take a look at that preset in the code what does it check? It checks that in app trades all the files are actually well trades. Also some people prefer the word concerns to be trades so preset checks for that one as well. Also enums are expected to be in the folder app enums and this is exactly what we'll try to break. In this project I have app enums, a few files here and let's rename the folder. So folder refactor rename to enum from enums. Okay and now we rerun the test again and we will see one failure. So preset of Laravel identified that the file in the app enum should not actually be enum. So this is just one example how it works and you can read the full preset of what is recommended. The folder app features comes from Laravel pennant package. This is the documentation for example for class based features which are exactly in that namespace and if you don't know what pennant is I have a separate course again on Laravel daily and I will link that in the description below and then more things are checked around app exceptions folder middleware model should extend model except for scopes because scopes could be class based scopes as separate files. Also checking there's no model directly in the app folder except for app models. At some point in Laravel models were indeed in the app folder from version 6 to 7 from what I remember. So a check for that then a check for form requests emphasizing the suffixes for those files which is important in my opinion. I really like to understand the purpose of the file from the suffix like command, request and others. And then the rules basically for each subfolder of the app. So mails, jobs, listeners, notifications, providers, then controllers and also important one expect the controllers to have only those public methods. In other words stick to route resources. In this case I think it's too strict and you may ignore some rules in the presets. For example in the docs we may find arc preset Laravel ignoring some classes. And the final expectation is of course to not have any of those methods in the production code. That alone could be the reason to use architectural testing of PEST in the first place. What do you think about this new feature of presets? Do you agree with all those rules in that Laravel preset? And will you use that in your projects? Let's discuss in the comments below. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.